So race is always going to be a topic of conversation, especially in this country. Well, not even just the country, all over the world, it's a conversation. So I think when we talk about these things, we have to be sensitive, but we have to also be real. I still stand on that Erica should never have called Spice a monkey. I don't care how angry she got, she should never have called her a monkey because what that lets me know is that she'll call any other black person, especially a dark skinned person, a monkey. She knows the implications of that word. I know she apologized and she's saying that it wasn't racial. Get out of here with that. Definitely it was. A lot of people say Spice should never have brought up Erica's child, but she didn't bring him up in a way where she was slandering her child. She was just saying that your son doesn't like you. Erica has always talked about how she had to leave her son with her mother and she did, She wasn't really there because she was out working, making money, rightfully so. However, Spice was just pointing out your son doesn't love you. But we have to backtrack a little bit because we also have to put it into perspective that Erica has been playing this sympathy role like, oh, I'm a single mother, I'm divorcee. Come on, there's a lot of single mothers out there. You're not the only one. And that's what Spice was saying. She was all like, I've been doing this for 14 years. And then Erica tried to run up her by saying, I've been doing it for 16 you're years. Like you're the first woman to be divorced and you're the first woman that's left with two children mm -hmm. to fend for. I've been doing it for 14 years. Welcome to the club. Girl, I've been doing it for nowhere. 16. Okay? 16. Okay, with 16 your son that don't teenager. like you. My son loves me. How do you know so that's about my son? Son? That's when Spice was all like, well, your son doesn't even like you. My son loves me. Saying like, hey, we might be single mothers, but we two different people. Now, that's more talking about Erica's parenting. I do not see that as Spice talking about her son or trashing her son. She is talking about the parenting because let's be honest. Now, granted, I'm not a parent. However, there are some parents out there who, who don't do the best. And so if you're commenting on somebody's parenting, that is not talking about the child. And like we said before, as far as her relationship with her son, I'm not going to harp on that. However, it has been mentioned plenty of times. Scrappy has said it. Safari has said it. So what makes Spice any different than those two? If we're going to say, hey, kids are off limit and they shouldn't talk about, well, we should also mention them as well, too. I think she saw Spice as beneath her, and that's why she was all like, you're a monkey. Now, necessarily do I feel that she hates black people, and I'm referencing Erica. No, I don't feel that she hates black people or anything like that, but does she kind of see herself better than maybe a dark-skinned black person or a dark-skinned black woman? Yeah, I think she has her own biases, and now if she wants to face them, that's one thing. If she doesn't, then hey, that's on her. Uh, somebody had asked her, did Spice ever apologize for bringing up her son, and then Erica said no, she wouldn't have the guts to apologize, so she still harbor feelings over what spice had said now i think she definitely should have just left that alone because again that still makes her look bitter and it also verifies like yo you just issuing this apology because you're losing jobs and you're trying to cover your ass but at the end of the day you can give a damn about what you said, you said you blue said. monkey you meant it Thank you.